Oh yeah, whatever happened? Did you get rid of like did you throw her out? No. No, okay. Throwing her right after last night would not have been a fucking good idea. It would have been things to have been more of a I headache. Said, I almost said it, bro. I almost said it. I almost uh, said it's it. not worth it. She made her choice. See that that oh. that's that's where like listen, I know you have your own crews and shit. That's why it's but not worth that's it. that's where it like that's where it gets so it got so toxic. That's where yep. it gets so like weird in a sense because it's like uh -huh. okay, there's CG, there's Hydra, there's Street Team, and I I know like nothing nobody will ever go to war with one another, but it's just situations like that. Something? It's just Wanna it just know, becomes weird. One other something personal that I believe, which is why I disagree with a lot of what she said. Um. You know how she like said like she felt like Hydra had too many people, so she went to go hang out with the next row branch of um you know of King Gang, go with street team. Yeah. I'll be real, Vinny. Why would she even say I, that? And I think and I and I, I think you can agree with this, bro. King Gang can have eight members and they'll bench you every single day of the, of the week. You're never gonna go hang out with anybody else because Chang Gang is your fucking family to that. <laughs> That's no literally what. labeling herself as a flopper. I, 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 right now, if I could get benched every single day, bro. Like, my family is my family. I'm not gonna go. Yeah, that, that's very to an extended odd. Family. I'm not gonna go to an extended family and, and make my excuse, oh, there was too many of us. No, I, I'm gonna make it work. Like, somehow, somewhere, whatever the case is, I'm gonna, I'll have family talks, whatever you wanna say. I, I'm not leaving my family because there's too many of us. I mean, I'll be real. I don't, yeah. agree with, I don't agree with what she said about that because. It was never about Hydra. It was about Flippy. I mean, think about it. That's just like saying, okay, well, I'm going to get benched with CG. I'm going to go fucking chill with the Mandem now. I'm going to go do things with the Mandem. It's like basically then, you're flopping on your own crew. Yeah. And then you're going to hang out with the Mandem mostly. And then when, when the CG comes up to you, what's going on? Oh, there's too many. Chad, and this is what I'm oh, talking about. Why it gets like, weird with all these other branches of gangs. This is why that's I say it always CG. gets weird when you branch off with you know, Hydra and behind. Street Team. And that's the part if where, they're part of a family, like, it should just be um, CG and that's yeah, it. Again, it doesn't bother because me. this is where it gets I, weird. I swear to God, it doesn't bother me. If people want to leave, if people don't want to hang out with this, it's your choice. You know, people have walked away from us. It, 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 it's up to them. We're gonna keep doing us. We have our main crew. You know, me and Mario have been writing together for a long time. That, that, that ain't changing. Yeah. And that, this is like, th this is the one thing I have an issue with that I've always said it. So, it, it it's weird in a sense because, right? So, Mari's stated that she's basically, there's too many people in Hydra. There's not much for her to do. So, she's going to have a street team. Now, can you consider that like her flopping? Yes, but can you really? Because at, at, in, at the end of the day, everybody is CG. So it's like, this yeah, is... No, it's not flopping. That's not No, flopping. but, but the, the my, my main... My main the, so my but main issue... Show, yeah, it is in a sense, Miguel, because like she's literally... She told Flippy, there's too many people in Hydra, so I'm going to go to Street Team. In my eyes, and I'm just going to be real with y'all, I get that you have your own crews and you do your own thing. This is the main reason why it should be just CG in the aspect of because of look what's going on. What's happening. Yeah, I mean, you understand? Sounds, I mean, that the truth that just comes down to that's the problem where there's just way too many CG around. Like, and labeling like 30 members CG is what ends up causing that though, right? 100%. 100% but like I said I just don't want it to get weird in the sense of like what you like like you just said about the whole so, shit that she said so, that uh, uh, So my question though when you see the reason um, I'll be honest uh, and I fucks with them I don't hope this comes out the wrong way, right? But we gave uh, Jalen a CG chain. So what happens between Jalen now? Picking between street team or or, or uh, CG Exactly what happens, if, what happens one day if um, you know Brandy gets pissed off at Bleach and shoots Bleach. What is Jalen gonna do? Well, that's my point, and that's why I said the same thing to y'all with Hydra. Golf a bit, say Bogo shoots Randy down, and then what happens to you guys? You know, Bogo's like Bogo's dead. Bogo's dead. No question. I know. I know that without a doubt. Yeah, but then you would have to, like, you know, I I expect obviously Jalen to react the same way. But this is what I'm saying. Why do we? It, so this might come out bad, but this is what I'm trying to say: is why do we need that added tension? You understand what I'm trying to say? Like, why is that added tension need to be there that we have to be put, that you boys have to be put in a situation like that? That's where it gets, it gets. I mean, I think that's why Flippy's always pushed the whole 
Hydra Gang's not a gang is because that's what he wanted to avoid, right? I mean, for the, I mean, obviously the last couple of days I've been saying it's a thing or whatever. Because honestly, there's like 30 people that we roll with in the mornings, but um, I tried to uh, uh, engrave in everyone's heads that Hydra wasn't a thing because it, it just I didn't want to push it into it as a different group. You know? Yeah, it's just it was just our morning crew, and if it ever came down to it, like these motherfuckers have to respect that I'm CG, and they do, they do. That's why Miguel, even before, even even when he was technically HOA, Miguel showed all respect to CG. Of course, Susan yeah. Knows Susie knows damn well that she better show CG respect. If not, she's gonna have problems too. Of course, All yeah. Those motherfuckers that I ride with in the morning, they know to respect CG. I am gonna be CG no matter what. And if they don't respect that, then that's their problem. If CG comes after them, then that's on them. So the way I want you to look at it, right? This is this is my outlook on it. God forbid. Just, I, this, I, I know this will never happen. Okay. How long do you know Susie for, right? Over two years. Yo, you, and she's a great friend. She's amazing, right? And you love everything about her. Hell no, we don't Not know everything, anything. though. Shut uh, up. Barely. Jay, let me call you right back, or do I have to just join the group? And what's going on? Uh, no, no, I just want to let you know that we're getting shit ready. So. All right, yeah, let me call you right. Let me call you right back. Okay. All right. So, so okay, so okay, so here, here's my take on it, right? Why can't I get out of this car? Uh, God forbid if any. And you are really close with Susie, right? She does a lot. Now, my look on it is this. After the, you've been CG for about a year, right? You, 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 you became a full CG member for about a year now. You have a longer relationship with Susie. Say if I was like, you know what, Flippy? Fuck Susie, I'm over her. Like, I, so, some shit just happened really bad. Now, I'm an OG CG member. If I tell you this, like, Flippy straight up, I don't want you to have nothing to do with Susie anymore, right? Is that right of me? No. no but see, right? But, but then what would you do? Would you cut off all ties with Susie and, like, not fuck with her ever again? See, that, that's not even... That's not even... That's not even a question you should ask. I, but the thing... That, that, would, that literally would never happen. I get that's it, but... Like, that's it, like you, saying you can't like never saying you Rami, can't really say that though, but right? But you don't know. But I just don't do that as a boy because that's like saying, what if Rami told the entire CG just like even though you guys are all close to Claire, just don't talk to Claire. Rami knows himself, like he doesn't like he's I've talked to him a lot about this. Rami knows that he himself doesn't fuck with the angels, and he hates that everyone is friends with them. But he's never gonna tell people not to hang out with. Them. No, I get that, but like I, I said, context I, matters on what you're saying, Vinny as well. So here's context the deal: say say. Then she fucks up. But would yeah. it be worth throwing that relationship that you build with Susie for so many years away? That's why. I, that's where yes, the confusion. Of course it does. Yes. Okay. Because Vinny, like I told you, everyone I roll with in the morning, they fucking know where I stand and they respect the shit out of CG, man. It, bro, Susie is not changing, but she will do anything for a CG member. Of course. She will die for a CG member because she knows where I stand. She knows these two are CG too. I just she don't want ever. I just don't want she ever never, anything to happen never. like that. That I'm just looking at the worst case scenario type deal. Like I don't want to ever see anything happen like that. That's the reason. Like I'm just going to the worst case. You know, like golf. Oh, I, know, I would I never ever want to put somebody in a position like that. It would be the Obviously, shittiest we both fucking know that's thing. That's going to happen. But you're, you're you're putting it into like, but like Miguel said, I think uh, context is key in what she did. Yeah. And someone like you, Vinny, for you to ever say something about Susie if you felt that way. She she probably fucked up big time. Yeah, and exactly. Yeah. Thing, obviously, what happened. But then, it, like, I just don't want ever anybody to feel in that awkward position if golf bit something would happen like that. That you would actually have to cut off somebody that you build a long term relationship with. Like that. That's where it just gets like that's like the worst case, and that's why I'm like I I don't want to ever fucking see that ever. Yeah, I'll be I mean, honest with you guys. I feel like here's my whole I take on this situation, right? And I've been watching from afar and <gasps> not caring about it because I. Listen, no matter what I say, I'm going to come across as biased to Flippy, right? Because Flippy's my boy. So everything I am say is probably going to get spun back on me. So I don't really say shit. But I'll be completely honest with you. I know we're just shooting the shit, but I think this should be the last of it. I don't think we should ever talk about this again. Because Chad, you got to look at it in that aspect, up. though, Chad. Gonna roll it up. Um, you're right. It's going to end up causing like some weird You, you got to look at the like worst case scenarios because that's, that's why that's why Vinny um, has always had an issue when oh, there's like so right. many so many night. smaller families involved with CG, you know, you know? No one should be talking shit about each other and we just I need know. to wait. Listen, I I think that on both sides last night from listening to it, I think that 
both people explain shit really wrong. Um, and I think that uh, ultimately, if Flippy fixed his shit with uh, with Jalen, then that's good. And Not that creepy. I, I never turned on her Flippy. creepy. I mean, that's what happens, right? But as long as there's still that somewhat respect and it is what it is. But I think we just got to bring it back to basics and just leave it be. Yeah. And over time, the shit will be good and it won't and it won't say anything. Alright, let me get my final ads. Alright, let's get it going. <clears throat> Chat, it's saying. Know, it's such a, it's such a sticky point, man. It's like both feel some type of way, and regardless of what you say, someone's gonna be wrong. Yeah, some. No, everybody's gonna, gonna have this. some. Fe yeah, everybody's gonna have hurt feelings, no matter how you look at it. Chat, the way I'm the way I look at it, chat, so this is the way I look at it, right? How long has Flippy, Mario, and Miguel been together, right? They've been together forever, right? They've been Okay, so let's let let's put Mario and Flippy together, okay? This is what I want you to look at, right? Mario is a full CG member, also a full Hydra member, right? Say if Mario really fucked up in CG. And everybody wanted him out of CG. Okay? He's done with CG. He's done. Like, he really fucked up bad. We're, we, we cut, we're cutting him off. Like, we want nothing to do with him anymore. How is that... How is that gonna sit with Flippy when we tell Flippy, Yo, Flippy, Mario's out of CG and we want nothing to do with him anymore? How did... Now, what if Flippy continues that relationship with Mario in the Hydra gang... And that relationship s still continues in Hydra Gang. Meanwhile, we told him we want him to have nothing to do with him. Is it right for us to say that to Flippy? You know what I'm saying? It, it just gets super awkward, right? Because just to say, like, if Golf Mitty would ever fuck up that bad, we throw him out of CG. Where is Flippy's stance with him with Mario in Hydra? And then where's Flippy's loyalty to CG and what he's going to do with Mario? It's just like it, that's why, like I always said, there's there's always going to be an issue when every like when we have multiple sectors of like of uh, CG, you know, with Hydra Street Team. It, it, it just it gets crazy, man. You know what I mean? Like that. That's the like that's that's the oh, only thing I say. Oh, we have to go make shit. Okay. Yo, oh, Element, I'm, nobody's terrible at mediation, you dumb fuck. Okay, I'm just, that, I'm just, I'm just um, trying to, I'm just trying to, I come I, up with the worst scenarios. It's called playing ADL devil's advocate, and it, it, nobody's trying to mediate, nobody's trying to do anything. It's the, the the thing that follows me and I keep saying in my head that this is the problem when you have too many off branches of CG, when you have when you have street team, when you have Hydra Gang. This is exactly what happens. Nobody's sitting here trying to fucking mediate. It's the factual things of what can occur and then putting people in a situation like that and then what do you do about it? Nobody's fucking nobody's trying to mediate at all.